Welcome, welcome, boys and girls, women and children. Uh, I don't even know what else to say. What up, everybody? Welcome to the We Sample Every... Oh, my God. <laughs> Blooper. Uh, <laughs> you, you, it's, it's there. You're right. It's same shit. <laughs> what up, what up? Welcome to What's In Your iPad podcast featuring We Sample Everything, Beat Makers the Squad, Dragonfly Bra, Cypher Omni, J1 Star Beats, a.k.a. Shadow Beard 904, right? 904? I think so. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, uh, I'm just calling Shadow Bear because he is the bear that's in the <laughs> shadows. You better watch yourself. <laughs> but we back, we back, and uh, yo, so what's good? Like, I know, I know, there's a hot topic. There's a hot, hot, hot oh, topic. Oh yeah. So, so should should we just jump right into it? Yeah, I'm ready for it, man. Well, wait, we should we should ask Bri what his first initial thought was when he seen it because we know what what we found out. But well, let's let people know we talking about. So. Just the other day, um, as as the time we're recording this, uh, Korg announced that they were uh, releasing the Chaos Replay. Uh, if you've seen it, um, it is when you first look at it, it joint looks like a, um, a SP, a future SP404 MK2. Like you thought the MK2 looked futuristic compared to like the uh, the SX and the A. Like this joint looks like a futuristic, futuristic. 44 Mark II, you know what I mean? Like had the big screen, touch screen. It, it, it didn't have all the knobs that the um that the 404 has, but it had the 16 pad layout um and then the touch screen. But you didn't need the knobs because the touch screen was is what how you um trigger the effects and how you like control the effects and stuff like that. And um yeah, the joint look. I mean, I ain't gonna lie. When I first saw it, I was like, ooh, like. You know what I mean? Like I was like Scooby Doo. You know how Scooby Doo would smell the food. <laughs> <laughs> I was just like that. You know what I mean? But and so, so like you know, that that joint was uh, announced this week, and and you know the first impression that everybody had. I think everybody had the same first impression. What 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 what'd you think, bro? Yeah. So I, I saw the um, I saw a couple people posting like uh, mm-hmm. that little blur page that had like a picture of it on there, and then like a couple. Like uh, details on what it does, just like some really, you know, sketch, you know, just basic type stuff. So for me, when I first saw it, I was like, damn, I might, I might end up having to get this, and then I had to sell my 404, right? But then that was my first thought. My second thought was like, you know what? Let's wait and see, like, what people think about the actual functionality of it. And let's see what happens when it drops, because um, you never know, really. I mean, it, yeah. everything's kind of shaped the same way you know like 16 pads you got like a little box everything's kind of portable so you have like a lot of devices mm-hmm. in the same category but um yeah i was on the fence i'm really uh, eager to hear what you guys think about it well well i'm glad you mentioned portable. <laughs> <laughs> i'm glad you mentioned that because you know i got i got forcia yeah that's her name forcia right here you okay know I mean? okay <laughs> and, and, and forcia is very portable super light you know what i mean but like the one thing that makes this portable that right there the battery the battery pack the um <clears throat> the chaos replay does not have battery power you can't even power it with a uh with a um what are those things the power usb bank. power brick? power bank yeah. so was it just pc can, only i mean computers nah you gotta um oh, 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 oh ac plug, jack plug in, yeah you gotta plug it into the wall i think uh, um and then um and then like the other thing is it has a usb c and a micro USB, right? Uh-huh. So the USB C is only for the power. The micro USB is what you're using to talk to the computer and back and forth. So it can it, it can work as an audio interface yeah. as well, yeah. you know, which is dope. Um, and you can drag and drop. I'm, I'm assuming you'll be able to drag and drop files like through that. Mm-hmm. But that's just that's the old micro USB. I think I got one of them around here somewhere. Oh, it's, it's over there. But um, but yeah, that's that's all you can use, like the the little like the PS4, the joint that charges the PS4 controller. Yeah, you I know, know what you're saying. Ch- yeah, charge the old Android phones. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? Yeah, the Android joint. So I don't know about you. I don't know if if you've ever had <clears throat> much history with those, but like me, I would go through like five or ten of those like easy because the uh mm-hmm. the end of that is always it joint always snaps off for something like really? that or it gets yeah i'll break them joints all the time uh-huh, oh yeah that's a known fact yeah, yeah. them shits mm-hmm. never last yeah at all at all i i got one now <clears throat> and i keep that joint in the case because <laughs> wow, wow. <laughs> like, i got because it's it so i use it to charge like i got this um 
this joint right here. This is the um, Rav Power yeah. uh, joint. Yeah. Used to, the joint we had to use before iOS got files. Yeah. Remember? Yeah. So if you want to, yeah. uh, to, to transfer files from uh, like a USB or like a, a flash card to your, to your iPad yeah. or something, yeah. you had to use one of these, but it also works as a, um, a power bank. So I, I literally use this and um, <clears throat> and the rip cord to power my uh, 404. Yeah, okay. You know what I'm saying? I forgot that's a power bank, yeah, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. I pull my shit out the closet. I yeah. think they last yeah, better than the batteries, too. I'm, I'm not, no, um, like the sample mm-hmm. track, East batteries, but the 404 isn't super good on batteries, on like a regular, like double A's, you mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Like, you can I go can for a little imagine. while, but it's, you, I mean, you eat them up, though. Mm-hmm. No, that's a uh, fact. You're right. Yeah. I, I can only imagine. But, the, the good thing about it is you can plug that into your iPad, you know what I mean, and power it that way, the 404. Mm-hmm. You can't do that with this uh, Chaos. Mm-mm. You can't plug that into the iPad and power it. No. Yeah, so. At least not yet. So I can you use a, um, I mean. the iPad to transfer, like, uh, as an um, interface when it's plugging in for power, too? I, th- I think you can use, use it... Uh, for, uh, for audio back and forth. I'm pretty sure it works for audio back and forth with the iPad. Damn. Uh, cause you it works, think? I mean... Because I, re- I I might be wrong, but I read somewhere only that micro uh, USB port is the only oh, audio that's right. so you you'd have, have. to So you'd have to have a, like a hub for the new for yeah. the new iPads and just the lightning connector for the old ones. So, right. You know. Mm. But, but, the camera uh, connector kit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah right, yeah, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know what you're talking about. Okay. Yeah. I need to try yeah. that though, because if that happens, um, that could open up a whole new realm for me, man. I might just put my iPad Wait. and my 404 like a couple. Oh, bro, it works. You just so all right. So which iPad you have? Um, does it have a button? Is it a Lightning connector or USB C? That's that's basically. Oh, uh, Lightning. All right. So since you got the Lightning, you got to make sure your um your 404 um is already po- has already has power. Mm-hmm. Um, so, and then, then just get a USB C to, um, to the, you know, one of those cables. Yeah, I got one. To regular yeah. USB. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. I got a couple of them. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. This one right here. That joint. Yeah, I got you get those. Yeah, yeah. And, and, and this, the USB C side goes in, in your uh, 404. Yeah. And this side right here goes into the, um, into the camera connection kit. And there's your audio interface. Uh, and it powers it too, though. No, 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 no. I, no. The lightning iPad plug your charger in. Can't can't power. You have to power with the um. You got to power with either the the um through the through the uh like the power port like the um what is it, this this through the DC in. You got to power it through that. But I'm saying so. Like if I had that same camera connector kit, right, and I plug up the um power part to it. You know how when you just showed yours, it has like a little other part where you put the iPhone the charger. charger, right? You plug the charger mm-hmm. in one side, the USB in the other side, and it charges your iPad up. It won't charge up the um, 404 too. No. Uh-uh. Oh, it no. don't. God, I don't think I haven't oh, tried it like that. Oh, I thought so, it did. Like you mean like when you plug the power into the um into the um. Look. I, I, yeah. I, yo, hold on. Give me. Give me. Look. You see this yeah, port, exactly. cheese? I'll find out right you now. Yeah, the plug... second part, you plug the iPhone power into. Yeah, huh? you could plug your yeah. Yeah, I know. I know exactly what you're talking about. Give me two seconds. I'm gonna find out right you now. Like my little game, bro. Yeah, dude, that's dope. <laughs> T- oh, yeah, Stop, turn it on. Cheese. Yeah, let's see. Yeah. <laughs> she's gonna make fun of me because I done burnt the first one out. <laughs> what is it? She, she blew one up already, what, bro. What, uh, what does it do? Uh, oh, I see it. It has all the old games. Ah, oh, that's dumb. Yeah, that's It got the original, know. like. Oh, it'll play it with that? It'll size. play on there? Yeah. Ah, shit. Damn, I didn't see that. That's Look. crazy. It's tiny as hell, but you don't need to see it. Like, just from what it is, I can see, tell the graphics. Yeah, like, like if you're just fucking around. I personally have a thing for tiny little things, mini things. I love mini things. So it was like, oh, shit, I'm getting it. But look, I'm playing it right now. (laughs) Yeah, that's what I was saying. I about to find out, moment of truth. I'm going to try it with the power bank and my phone. Yeah, let's see. All right, here we go, here we go. Yeah, because I thought it worked. That'd be awesome if it did. That would have been a whole that, new category for me. Like, I just put those two nah. things, like, a, you know what I'm saying? It don't work. Mm-mm. Damn. I ain't get no power to the 404. Mm. Whatsoever. Yeah, because I ain't gonna front, Bri. That's one of my favorite things about um the, the 404. When I take that outside with me, I take the iPad with mm-hmm. me, and I just power it up with the iPad. And Because I'm also... I have the iPad plugged in anyway because... I'm transferring my samples probably back and forth, so I just leave it there plugged in and, and let that shit sit. 
That's a plus for me. Yo. That's one of the things when I saw this chaos, I was like, oh, I, I said the same thing as you. I put the live two for sale. I was like, I'm selling that. <laughs> nah, <man. laughs> and I'm getting it. They know their effects are good, though. Looks... That's one thing about it. Like, chaos, I, like, mm-hmm. when I saw it, I was like, okay, well, we already know they make effects and they're already, like, mm-hmm. in that right. area real deep. So if they already know that the 404 is out and they're trying to go against them, they might put some better effects in that joint. And not to say right, better, but here's but, the thing. I don't know. You know, it's comparable. You yeah. could you could only use one effect at a time. Ah, uh, yeah. Mm. On that. Well, so it's like it's also the, it's like the first time that they came out with this product, right? A lot of stuff they can upgrade through software updates. You know what I'm saying? See, and that's 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 to me like when I, when when I like for me, I think what they're doing right now is they they announced it to let everybody see it in this state. Because they was like, yo, we're not going to put it out like this unless people really, really mess with mm-hmm. it. Mm-hmm. I think, I, you know, I think everybody that got one, like in my in my opinion, you got you. It had to be a beta. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like, like the the, the software still got to be a beta. Because like when they were doing certain things, like uh, switching samples or something like that. Like I was watching a video, it would take like a little, little time. You press the button, and it's like, oh, hold on, loading. Mm-hmm. I peeped that. Loading. Doop. You know what I mean? And, but like, and, and, but then, yo, you know what the other thing is though? Yo, the um, the um, the ins and outs, it's RCA connectors. Facts. They might did that to be different. Now I could, I, yeah, I, I, I can get care, past man. that. I don't care about that. Yeah. Yo, listen, my 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 four four got the. I keep these mm-hmm, in here. Mm-hmm. You know right. what I'm saying? Because I I be sampling from from like my phone, and my phone has a. Uh, I use the head the headphone connector. If I'm not using it through the USB, I got the headphone connector to the um you know to the uh to the art to the RCA joint. So that's mm-hmm. just there for it. So I'm not mad at the RCA because like they not only they put an RCA, they put a um uh they put a turntable ground. It has a it has a turntable. Oh, band. that's the yeah, that's where they're going then. They're going to the DJs then. Here's mm-hmm. your DJ four oh four, I got you. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, that's what they said. They said this was made for DJs and not beat makers more. I, so. Yeah, I think I saw mm-hmm. that. Yeah, like I said, here's your effects box for your turntables, and if you want to cook up a little beat, here that is too. Yeah, cause it, no, nah, but you can't. It's no sequencer on it. Really? Yeah. That's another problem. <laughs> no so, sequencer. Yeah. No sequencer. That's so. That's the only thing that Micro um, SD the four card. four is still kind of working on, and that can, you know, hopefully they'll do an update on that too. Now, if they get the four four. Sequencing up to date, kind of like um, the MPC, it'd be over. Like, and and I I use the you know the sequence strength and stuff like that. But I think I see like a lot of people just using the um, step edit, going in step edit mm-hmm. mode and just getting it done like that. But man, it's like, mm-hmm. uh, but you, you know. but you know, listen, man, hey, that that's you you gotta you 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 on a Mac, right? Yeah, I got Mac. Uh-huh. All right, yo, download that 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 full full app. Bro. Yeah, I got then, it. Would you <clears throat> Alright, so then you can open it up as VSC three, right? Um, and then you can just you can just sequence it sequence the four oh four from your uh from your door. Yeah. It might not so I got I'm on my hobby on my um a power Mac. I got it's like a five comma one. My joint's from twenty twelve, oh, man. Oh. My joint's old as hell, but it's still kicking butt. <laughs> what door you use? Um Bitwig mostly. But I got Pro Tools on oh, it. Yeah, yeah, you did say you that. Know. But you, I mean, even still, even you don't even. But I, truth be told, you don't even need the app. Like, all you gotta have, all you gotta make sure to do is make sure your um your um your your four four is plugged in um as a you know through the through the USB yeah. and it's gonna send MIDI to it. Oh, I know what you're saying. MIDI. Yeah, yeah, right, right. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. So like it, it ain't nothing but it, like you got that that, that one cable sending MIDI and audio. Yeah. And and you just use that if you don't because like I I'm still like on the fence about the four uh, four's um sequencing. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? But like, mm-hmm. uh, and what I've been, like what I do back and forth is I, I sometimes I'll just sequence the 404 for a reason. Like, you know, but like I'm, I'm doing my best to, I, like I want to really, really learn the sequence because I want to use it on its own. Like I want to lay in bed and make beats. And that's, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, so I can't keep bringing my laptop, uh, 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 you know what I'm saying? So, mm-hmm. but, uh, but yeah. Well, I'll tell you this, but, yes. Um, but I'll tell you the one thing about the 404 when you use uh, um, outside MIDI sequencer, it's dope because it's like every single key is one of the pads mm-hmm. you know so like out mm-hmm. of, what's it like 88 keys you might have like one you know a couple transposes up but you can get every single um pad on there and then when you want to yeah. change the sound you just you know hit your little the little uh edit you know, yeah. edit one up and and the dope thing about it is like you can like 
So it's like a plug-in, but there's like that you could like hold in your hand. Yeah, you know what yeah. I mean? Like when you're doing it like that. Yeah. So like, so if you if you need to change something on the sound, you could just you know, you do whatever you gotta do to to, to make it happen. You know. Mm-hmm. But uh, but I'm 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 still like I still want to see what Korg is gonna go with the uh, this chaos <coughs> song. If they're gonna actually like, if they're actually gonna like hear listen to the feedback that they got. And, mm-hmm. and 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 do something or if they really want to just release that box like that at that price well I, I was just gonna say can we talk about the biggest problem <laughs> that 999 what's that Woo! And, oh that's how much it is that's the price the, it's it's stock, yeah. nah, nah, nah. well they're trying to come right. in NPC then so they, so what they probably are doing they're putting it out in alpha not even beta right they'll let people buy mm. it and then they'll have complaints and then they'll tell the engineers to start fixing that first and then um eventually they'll come out with some really good stuff i tell you so like the sample track um was kind of like that too man like um mm-hmm. it came out and it did some stuff and it was like if you had patience you could make something on it right because it, it wasn't buggy but it just was kind of not fully implemented right mm-hmm. then when it came out that version two and then three it started making more sense lo-fi 12 same thing the first one like it was cool using parameter lock man but when they came out the drum sample shop it was like a yes. game changer, right? And then I started using it a lot more. And the thing is, like, the company will make the hardware capable of doing certain things, but the software might still be immature because they got to code that in. They might need a special coder that knows how to program, like, the language for whatever the hardware is, right? So, like, mm-hmm. uh, they'll they'll get an engineer to do it, and they'll make their design and all that and let it do stuff. And then later, it comes out, you know, doing everything that you want to do, but they just, like... Mm got money first to pay that guy to finish writing the code mm. you know what i'm saying like it, it mm-hmm. might be like very, a basic yeah, you know what i'm saying they're like well we mm-hmm. already paid our money out for the engineer to design it and we already paid a prototype you know we got like a hundred units that cost like almost cost you know like a you know decent price we won't get a profit on this first batch sell this batch and then pay that to finish the software not to say that they're, they're, I don't think they're it's not cheap, work in this but I'm case. saying like they're a big company, but at the same time, like if you look at, at some projects, some stuff does go like that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Facts. Yeah, I can I, well, I mean, I mean, the only thing, the only other stuff that I've seen, well, I mean, just music production wise, that, that Korg, that I've seen Korg putting out lately has just been like their vocals. Like, uh, mm. and then, but no, don't they got those little mini the Junos, just, they got those little mini synthesizers uh, from the uh, 80s. That whole look. No, that's that's uh no, that's rolling. Bro. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, right. You're talking about yeah, the boutique yeah, yeah, sims, yeah, right? right? Yeah, right, that's yeah, rolling. That's right. Yeah, damn. Yeah, yeah. Cool. yeah damn. Now, but see, Cole's here's putting, the thing Cole. with that. Mm-hmm. If they can do all of that, but you still can't fix all the shit on the outside everyone's complaining about. Mm-hmm. So you could probably fix with some firmware updates the stuff everyone's complaining about on the inside. But a lot of people, that battery thing is a problem. The RCAs, yeah. the micro SD, all of that is a problem yeah. for a lot of people. Yeah, software won't change a lot of that. Mm. Right, you, know? you can't. What you, you going? Know, yeah. True. I See, don't get the uh, micro SD part. Yeah. yeah. Oh Why yeah, they that did too. That? Yo, I hate them joints. Me I too. Hate, I hate them because them joints are so easy to lose. Like the SD card alone, like an SD card it, 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 within itself is, 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 you know, this is easy enough to lose. Right. So now you're going to tell me that, the, the, like, I got to uh, save everything onto something that's a fraction of this size? Hell no, dude. You know what I mean? Like, like, it's just more stuff you have to buy to be able to use it. You know yeah. what I mean? Mm-hmm. But well, Roland, not Roland Korg, I'm sorry, Korg, if you're watching and you want us to show everyone how to use it, because everyone's saying it's only for for performance, if you want us to show everyone how to use it, as, as a beat maker, send one through, come and on we'll over send it row. around the, the team. <laughs> <laughs> right. Come on and, and over we'll, the death row. <laughs> we'll show everyone how to use it, because you know, we, we're the team that, uh, we're the workaround team. <laughs> we're going to make a workaround and make it work. Yeah, yeah. But, and, but I mean, yo, I, I ain't gonna lie. Appearance-wise, that joint looks. Oh my God, joint. I like what you call. What did you call it? I love what you called like a, it. Is it like a super futuristic four no. four MK two? What? When you said the SP bully, I was like, oh shit. And, yo, at first yeah. that's what it looked like, <laughs> right? Um, it looked like yeah. Yeah. yeah, at first I was like, yo, they really like. I, I thought, I, yo, I was like, oh, shots is fire. Like, call is like, <laughs> like what you can do, we can do better. But yeah, <laughs> anybody done any videos on it yet? 
Um, there's, not there's like review videos and stuff like that, but like I ain't seen a beat video though. Yeah, yeah cause you, can, you it's no sequences. So you oh, really oh, right. Ah, damn. Nah, that's right. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> nah, they, that's it. They, nah, they're done. Yeah. They need to put a sequence. Like, yeah. But I think, but I mean, the name itself tells you it's not a beat. It's like it's a replay yeah. joint. So it's made for like I, I would say like for a DJ or for somebody that's like doing a live performance like literally like and I'm not talking about the person that with the beat I'm talking about like yo we got a show tonight oh snap you got the instrumentals yeah yeah I got them on my replay boom I press one button and there goes you, there goes the back right. and track. Like you can make a drum loop you, know if you can have a kick and a snare on there and you probably need to hit like right. st- start loop and just do analog and then just stop yeah. and let it do that no no I'm talking like about like a, an entire like three to five minute or or, or, or like a whole back and track yeah. for like for you know for for a vocalist to to be doing whatever they gotta yeah, do. Yeah, know what you're saying. You know, like you know what I mean. Like, cause then they they had a joint like called a replay years ago. It looked like a like a little a, like a little calculator or something like that. Like a mm. like a, a like a cash register, not a calculator. Mm. It was a white machine it had buttons on it, and like that's literally what it was for. They would you would just load up all your all your um your TV tracks or whatever that you want to call them. And boom. And like, you know, so instead of having a DJ playing the joints off the vinyl, he, like you just got somebody back there pressing the button. Like, you know. That's my Yeah. 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 He plays games and stuff like that with my guys. Mm. Yeah. But, so. you know, as a DJ, some of these things are still limiting to me. Like, I'll tell you the one thing that I heard that literally turned me off I said, take that live off of that eBay right now. (laughs) Was that battery and that plug-in situation? See the sequencer for me. I got time for all of that. If you can't sequence nothing, like Mm -hmm. you, you're really done. Like, so you chop up a bunch of samples on there and you just get ready. Yeah, but as a DJ, as a DJ, I could live without that sequencer just using that machine. What I'm saying is, like, if you know how they said it's for live performances, for just finger drumming live. Yeah, I get it. I could, I could, yeah, I could see that, but you still have a ton of things on there that is a is a, a constraint. It's it's messing. Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah, like yeah. that but plug I, alone. I mean, and see, my thing is this, right? Korg has, I Korg had put out the Triton. I had the Triton. That had a sequencer on it. So yeah. like, I, I mean, I know that was yeah, like twenty yeah, years right. ago or whatever. Exactly. I got a Triton right here. You know what I mean? <laughs> Yeah, right you know what I'm party. saying, and, and I mean the Volkers got sequences on. <laughs> Listen, like you said, those shits might come in the firmware. I, I'm, I'm it definitely I'm, probably will. I'm sure. That, I'm I'm a hundred percent sure that they uh, like they 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 put this out just to test just to check the temperature. It's mm-hmm. like yo, let me see let's see what people think about this right now. You know what I mean? But like that, but I don't know because that joint uh, or that 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 what's that? Uh, Thoman Thoman music. I, mm-hmm. I don't know. I don't know if I'm saying it correctly. But um, it said that um, that joint was gonna be available. What like about twenty Fif- weeks or something like that? Yeah, fifteen, sixteen weeks. Yeah, is what that's I've like been four seeing. months. <clears throat> yeah. Um, that's, that's not I don't a lot know, but that also doesn't really make a fix up a, a firmware, is it? Yeah, I mean, it, you know what I mean. Maybe we could, maybe we could do it in weeks. I think Bri was right. I think Bri mm-hmm. hit it on the head when he said they're trying to get that pre-order money into mm-hmm. you know fund the rest. Yeah, well they well, they messed that pre-order up. I'll tell you that. Man. Might be like a tester I, product yeah, to see what they, they want to do next. Just like since since they don't have anything out. I'll tell you what, would be dope though is if they went into that area like um rolling and make those little mini synths like from the eighties. Like take the eighties ones mm-hmm. and make the little tabletop versions of it with no keys. Mm-hmm. Like just MIDI, mm-hmm. you know, like we'll you put it you. against like a, a pocket operator, you know what I'm saying? Or like one of those little um mm-hmm. Korg had those little effect those little small joints already. Right. Yeah, yeah. So- I mean that's the effects what, joints like that, um, that little mic, like the duo, and then the, the um, yeah. analog delay yeah. joint. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So like if they took yeah, that I to like the one next level up, like make it like two thirds bigger and put like real piano keys on instead of that ribbon, and then mm-hmm. you could kind of mm-hmm. like do something. You know what I'm saying? They could put CV on there and like let it be for like boutique cats that want to have like a CV, I mean, like a tabletop mm-hmm. modular type thing. That would mm-hmm. make money right there, yeah, man. And then take the 80s joints you know not that you could like dump the old sounds and even you know hopefully not sis sis x but you know you could midi dump the old 80s patches to it and then play your song you know what i'm saying but you know they they, they kind of did that with the uh remember like the uh the ms20 they made they, they released remember, the ms20 I mini you know because I, I have that yeah. i love that joint. and you can put that, the old patches sense. on there 
Well, I mean, it's there's nothing. To, there's no. There's no. No way for you to save the patch. Remember, that's the joint. It's a semi modular set. Oh, so you, oh, you, you, you I know. You're plug saying. in a replug. I got you. Yeah. You yeah. know what I mean? And then, um, and then uh, they also have re-released. Uh, well, I don't know if it was a miniature version of the same size, but the uh, the Art Odyssey. Oh, okay. Okay. Remember, yeah, Cole, yeah. Cole, yeah. I, I released yeah. that. I mean, that joint, yeah. I, I ain't gonna lie. I was. I was. I was in love with that joint because it came with a little briefcase mm -hmm. and everything like that. I was gonna get it till they released the app, yeah. and I was like, "Uh oh, no, I'm good." <laughs> it's a weird form factor to have thirty dollars versus a thousand. No, I mean with, with the money too, but like I'm not yeah. like that's the one thing I'm kind of like really staying away from. It's like the modular stuff, right? And not because it's bad, but, mm -hmm. but one, it, it looks like it's kind of hard to like make a whole song on there. It's like no real sequencer except for those little modular type deals right you know kind of like some mm -hmm. kind of random generator type things right but then two you get addicted to collecting all those modules and like so just like that ms20 mm -hmm. it's like once you get to a point where you like patching and teenage engineering got a couple good good you know modular joints too but i, I like i kind of stayed away for the same reason because once you start getting like one it's a wrap your bank mm -hmm. account's about to get hit because every month you'll be like oh i need yeah. to pl if I plug this into this clickety click box and then I go to the doop doop doop, <laughs> and then I get a, a, a rewinder forward generator, and then I get, and then so I have weird names too. It's like I get this, you know, earthquake generator, monster, pink Valentine, strawberry ice cream. I'm not getting strawberry ice cream module. I, that's really the one that I need. You know, what I'm saying strawberry ice cream mountain top is really, uh, the, you know, what I'm saying. <laughs> Dude, and then it's like I'll be up in this joint. It'll be a, a wrap on Saturday, Sunday. I'll be like patching. Like, but it'd be like a random thing too. Like, if you get something, like, you, what do you, you just record it and say copyright that? And that's what yeah, I've never really seen people on the dance floor get down to my see, stuff, man. Yeah, you know what I'm see, to me, like, like I, I remember, like, so there's I, I, I was this close to getting into modular until I realized that every module was so expensive, yeah. right. Like I like the idea for me was 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 hard body. I was like, yo, I could just buy each piece of the synth and put it together, and I was and I was like, oh, let's go. You know what I mean? But then when I seen like just like the like oscillator, like <laughs> like not even a filter, the envelope, and not the oscillator, just that yeah. by yourself, <laughs> and it's not cheap either. That's just one that's one rack like, part too. Yeah, I'm yeah. like, yo, that, that, that's. So that's that's month one. Uh, that's all we can do is e something else, <laughs> you know like a filter bagel. Wow. <laughs> yeah. You know yeah, you yeah. know what I mean? But like there's a the keyboard. Three G's later. Yeah. Hey, what you seen the um Three. what about the O Coast? The Zero Coast, you seen that one? I know it's, it's not yes, even new. Uh, it's been up for a while. It's, it's like a little it's, tabletop box. It's a little little yeah, tabletop yeah. joint. Yes, yeah. I so I that. thought about that, I right? That but it's it's still the same thing because like you're still kinda like patching and then I was seeing people like, here's the O Coast in the Moog, X, you know, X Y Z, and it's like, ah oh, man, mm -hmm. nah, nah, I'm not, I'm not going there. You see, I like knobs and stuff see, like that, I, but like the patching, as soon as it gets there, that's why I think I'm stopping. Yeah, no, I see. For me, I, I like if as long as the synth can work by itself. I don't, I don't need nothing where I gotta put, I have to put something else with it. Like that's why, I like the um the NTS one yeah. that joint, like I had it for a little while, then I was like, yo, it's like. It can do stuff, I just you know what I mean? It. But like, yeah, I I, I saw yeah. your video with it. Like, it, it I like the joint, but like for me, it just after a while, I was just like, yeah, I'm good. And so I was like, yeah, let me just get get rid of this now. You know what I mean? But like, but um, but nah, it, it, like the it's, they got this one keyboard right where it's a mod, it's it's a MIDI keyboard, and um, and it has like the open rack for you to put modules in. I forget what it's called. But like the keyboard itself, I, I think it's a couple couple hundred dollars. It's, it's not actually not a bad Man. price. Like when you think about it, it's like the price of a yeah. mini controller. And then you then you buy the uh, modules and it has certain mini uh, uh, a certain number of uh, spaces yeah. in there. That that right there had me like, yo, I'm I might consider buying one. But then I thought about the price once you get all of them mo all of them modules or whatever they call it together, and the fact that I could. I have to be like a, a rocket scientist just to get mm. like get it to play two note polyphony, and it's not even gonna be polyphonic. It's probably gonna be paraphonic. You know what I mean? And, and they might have some polyphonic uh, modules, yeah. but like, how much a polyphonic module? Well, what, what's your recall? You, know what you have like a, a Polaroid camera. You be taking a bunch of iPhone shots and be like, "Here's my rig. If I want to get this sound again, here's what I got to turn back to." And you can take a 
picture of every single knob and then like write a date on it and mm -hmm. put it in a folder and then send that back to yourself. And then you're like, oh, okay, let me get my base patch out. You go on another computer and pull out all your pictures, like the 10,000 pictures you got. And then you're like, wait, wait, hold on, let me go. It was the number third. I think it was number three base. And then you open up the number three base folder, and there's like 20 pictures in there. And then you have to go to your module one and put Yo. one thing on six and one on seven. Then you're like, oh, man, I need more wires. I had more wires back then, and I loaned two wires out. Like, man, instead of just in the preset and tweaking it, you know, yeah. it's like the work. I'm not saying... Mm -hmm. For purists, I'm sure they love it, but it's like my goal is, mm -hmm. is not. I mean, I can make weird sounds too. That's not a problem either. We got plenty of effects and generators mm -hmm. and you know all types of things that, that make it weird without kind of like going through jumping through kind of like circles. It might not be productive though. You know what I'm saying? Like the 404 yeah, yeah. is different because it has those effects. It's digital. It's right there, and you can just go right back to the one that you mm -hmm. want and start changing. You know, and there's a lot. Say it's like 50 years, what 30 or 50 or whatever effects on there, right? You could go through all the mm -hmm. effects and then be like, oh. For this right here, I know I want to use lo-fi, and I'm just going to turn these knobs kind of like a deep, mm -hmm. you know, different from what I did last time, but it'd be kind of close, you know. The immediacy of it, man, it's like... Yeah, that's what exactly I was about to say, like how instant yeah, that shit is, yeah. yep. I don't know if that's even a word, man, but you know what I'm talking about, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah nah, nah, but like, like, because I got the, um, the vocal modular, right? And I, and I do the same thing you were talking about. Like, I would just t snap pictures. But what I started realizing after a while, I was like, yo, if I make a patch on this, right, I'm just going to make as many loops as I can with this one patch. And I'm I'm okay with losing this patch yeah. forever. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You it's just like, like, I got... <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's like, because you ain't going to save every patch. And when you try to go repatch it, something, something's not going to sound right. You're not... Something's not going to be turned where it's supposed to be turned. Like like yeah. you said, you know what I mean? It's never going to sound exactly the same. So you just... I and, go through you know, that now with that joint. That the, drum... Uh, oh, that... Uh, the that drum joint. one, right? Yeah. yeah. You see, I got it set up where hopefully nobody will touch it. And <laughs> I could probably get back to what I was doing <laughs> with the wiring. But mm -hmm. you never get that shit back the same once... Once yeah. you, you get off that shit for five minutes. If you have a good yeah. editor, yeah. Though, so like, if you have a software editor, that's what saves a day on that. So like the NTS, I got uh, that that uh, Mac version of the NTS editor, and then I download a whole bunch of SysX patches, like a bunch of files, right? Mm -hmm. And I just go through it like a menu, and I can go through like two, three hundred sounds on the NTS one. They're all different. I can come right back to it anytime I want. I could dump a patch that I make mm. on there too, right? But it works, uh, you know, works through um, that micro USB to the computer. And then um, I can't really use a standalone in that same way, right? So if I plug it up where the MIDI is going to the NTS, I'd need to keep it connected to the computer to use patches. Like, that's the only single way you can do it through an editor. You know what I'm saying? So, like, it's good, but it's kind of, like, limited how good it is when I use it. So on that video I just shot, I just mm -hmm. used the RK, the RK8 a little calculator sequencer, right? And that would, that would mm -hmm. that can change the sound. Mm -hmm. well, well, it might be able to, but I don't know how to. And plus, I don't know how to like load up a bank. It's not really. It doesn't have a storage bank to save a bunch. Of, I'd have to load that into there somehow and then dump it back out. It's it's just weird when you're off a computer. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, uh, I don't know. That's that's it, like to me all that work. Like it's it's just all that work to get a sound. And then it's like, damn, oh, yeah, now I got to make the yeah, beat. Yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> or if you had a beat, then you need to make the sound. Well, sometimes it's better that way, though. Because then you like you know what kind yeah. of hole you want to fill. And then you can just like, be like, ah, uh, okay, this is pretty close. I think I'm just going to kind of stay here and mess with this one, patch a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But um, mm. yeah, from scratch. Yeah. yeah. But to each his own. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, everybody got their got they yeah. workflow. Yeah. You know? Cause I, I don't want people to march the community and think that we definitely not. Them. No, no, I respect them all the way, man. Yeah. And like that's what I'm saying. If that's your thing, and, and they don't care about me saying it anyway. You know, they're like, who are you? Because yeah. <laughs> I don't have no modular. Yeah, exactly. I mean, like the biggest thing is my fake tabletop modular, my OP ones and, and little you know calculator shit and stuff like that. But mm -hmm. yeah, nah, man, I can't do the wall. Mm. So. It's like you say you got you got like you you got pros and cons. To what modular stuff? For the uh, nah, no, nah, for, uh, for, for the chaos. Um, I think we already <laughs> just went through them really because we oh, had oh, 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 no sequence. We had and then the battery connection for yeah. sure. And the price. The pros like the effects one. might be dope. Mm. Pretty much. I mean, they might have had me if this pro. was a five hundred dollar machine. The biggest pro. Yeah. The Yo, I, I ain't gonna hold you. The price, if 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 if, if it was half the price. 
I would have sold two, three things that I don't work just to have it there, mm -hmm. just because I, because like it, it just the the effects and you, you, you know me, I love court. You know what I mean? Like so, like that right there alone, like I'd have been like, yo, I, I'll take this. This is like a, it's, it's, maybe this is something that maybe in the future it'll be a little bit better. But like, nah, a thousand, nah, I'm good. Like, the oh. visual alone sold me. When I, when you cheese, you send me the picture first. That's the first time I seen it. I was like, I want it. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it does, but I want it. Yo, I ain't gonna lie. When I first see it, I was like, nah. And my and my back of my back of my head is like that shit is whack, <laughs> right? Because <laughs> like, that was me. Because that because the that was the back of my head was like hell no, nah, I ain't gonna let your gas kick in. No mm -hmm. sir, no sir. <laughs> that shit kicked on on me asap. I was like, oh, I want it. I don't know, but I want it. Yo, bro. Oh, that's the one thing we forgot to um mention. When you use it as an audio mm -hmm. interface, right? You get two. You get two. Two mm. two tracks of audio in, but thirty two tracks of audio out. On what? Yeah, on that chaos. 30, thirty from the chaos. Like so, when you use that yeah. as an interface through that micro USB to your computer, <laughs> <laughs> that micro USB is, is uh, carrying thirty two tracks okay. of audio. That's a lot. I don't know. Yeah, that. bro, I think about yeah. it now. Yeah. <laughs> no, I mean, I, I'll never need that, but I see. So, like, if you're going to yeah. a mixer board, you can mix each one, I guess. But like, if you can't mm -hmm. sequence it, then it's kind of like why you can set the level of each one inside the box i'm sure and then you can just make this one louder and that one lower and just hit them like why why you know? i guess i guess if you got like let's say you got 16 like if you got if for some reason you have all your stems like you want to put it back you got them all in there you can like hit one pad and one pad and maybe if they got the the the, the feature where you, you can link the pads maybe you could link all 16 pads you press one and it triggers all 16. Hmm. But like at that point, how'd you get it in there if you didn't have it like that already? Though, like, why would you need it back like that? Like, you see what I'm saying? Like, so many ways around yeah, that, man. That's, a, that's not solving our problem, really. Like, yeah, uh -uh. you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know that anybody that's like, you know what? Time, I need 32 a, a digital outputs. Yeah, yeah, one effect for 32 things. I'll just play a bunch of sounds, but then I affect one of them, or or affect mm -hmm. all, you know, I need 32 <laughs> things to play at a time, but they all need to have this one effect. Like, I, yeah. I don't know, man. I mean, but um, I guess it's just me. Like, but I'm not a DJ. I'm not, not really. Nah, no, it's not just you. <laughs> Try you know, us. it's not just you, bro. Like, like, if, if, yo, let me tell you. The, I forgot what day it was they announced it. I think it might have been Wednesday they announced it. By Thursday, like, it's like people was wiping their wow. ass. There was a online. shit storm on YouTube. You know, what I, mean? I should but look like, and see. And and I I think mostly it was cause like you they knew it was like it was like oh snap like. You can get you can get clicks yeah, and views, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like like but like like but I think also it was cause people was like, yo, it looks so dope, it looks so dope. And then then they realized like, that, oh no. It's not that dope, <laughs> it's switch. not that dope. You know it's what I mean? Switch, and so it's yeah, they had to yeah. switch because they didn't want nobody going being like, yo, I bought this because I saw it on your channel and you said it was gonna be fire and I got it. You know what I mean? Like like Man, that sucks. What the one guy said, one guy said, yeah, he started the video with this was going to be sponsored by Korg, but now, never mind. Then he ended the video like, okay, I'm going to, they send me this, but I'm going to go ahead and pack it up and ship it pack right it back. Mm. Send it right back. And I was like, oh, and, shit. And, yeah, nah, he, 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 he went in. Mm. And it was like, and he, uh, he was like, uh, what he said? He said, "Yeah, listen to the listen to the the, uh, the synth. Like they, they they had like a demo song in there. He's like, yo, this reason, this right here alone lets you know how how bad this is. He played the demo song, and that demo song was like almost like one of my first beat oh, tracks. No. You know what I mean? Yeah. If they they just need to make an MK2 to that that machine that they that they got. They like, but I, I, I'm assuming like if, if if they already got it already available for pre order." that they must at least have some units like ready yeah. you know what i mean like besides, aside from the ones that did a few that they sent out you know what i'm saying i so. still tell you man like Word. mark ii for like the 404 mark ii it is like 90 98 95 percent there right if they do like a little bit of work on that sequencer and then like um i saw a couple cats that said if it had song mode if you had like song mode the dj mode is cool but like people don't use that all the time but if you had like a better sequencer a little bit and then you could do song mode it'd be a rap you can't but you can can't you change you can, yeah. you can, oh you i guess you might get a pattern change but they have to be like in a row though yeah. huh? 
And you yeah, say like how yeah, many repeats per pattern I, per per pad? You can say repeat like a couple times per so pad. You, I guess I, you know, I'll be honest with you. I haven't even like really gotten into to like, like I told you. Like I'm, I'm still I'm still digging back into yeah. the sequence and everything like that. You know what I mean? Like because like for me, like I, I I was using like to sequence. I this this week when I was getting back to it, I was sequencing mm-hmm. live, mm-hmm. right? You know what I mean? But when I first started messing with it, was after they had put out the um, the update that gave you the uh, the step sequence. Oh yeah, sequence. right, right. And so once they gave you step sequence, I was like, oh, <laughs> this ain't nothing but a big yeah, ass pocket out. Right, there. right. You know what I mean? Like, like, <laughs> yeah. Um. So I will tell you who has that good though, the sample track, bro. So like the sample track pattern sequencer is almost just like what we. It's like Ableton mm-hmm. Live almost. So like you have all your clips mm. going like like one whole like up and down to be your you know twelve tracks or whatever, and then you can have like mm-hmm. a second sequence, third, fourth, fifth, all you know like I guess up to ten sequences, right? But then it's an editor where you can go in and say how many times you want each one to repeat. So like you say the yeah, third yeah, one repeat four that. times, yes. just, to, just the hook, and mm-hmm. then let it go to the bridge, and then come back and on the second verse let that do twice. You know then you just hit play and it goes through everything. You know like for like hardware sequence, I mean mm-hmm. I think that MPC has been did that. I mean but you know. That you just hit your patterns mm-hmm. how many times you wanted to repeat it's like a scroll bar you know but i think this is necessary for anything that's like a hardware that's aimed at beat makers right because like how can you finish you know what i'm saying like yeah so like right. the, um yeah how can i how can i get yeah. from this loop to 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 a full i mean it's like lo-fi 12 mm-hmm. doesn't need it really because it's really just four tracks right but i bet you that new lo-fi 12 is going to have it because like built into the sample track but you could you could you could also change sequences on the yeah, uh, yeah, 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 you can yeah. you, you, you can change sequences on that one. So like, cause it, cause cause uh, yeah, I mean even with just mm-hmm. the four tracks, like, damn man, now you just remember remember that that changed four tracks and the low five twelve XC is probably I think it's eight tracks, three times as many. Well, no, I think oh, it might eight? be more tracks, but I think it's an eight track sequencer. And then the low the real sample track we got has yeah. like a. Um, 12 track sequence or something. I think that, that you know. I, don't, I, don't, I haven't used that one in that long. Because when I had it, I think I, last time I used it was uh, when it still was in version 1. Okay. Or something like that, 1. Point whatever. Like, and that's it. I remember how frustrated I was, how frustrated I got just trying to put together, put something together. And I was like, yeah. Mm. I put that train in the box and I was like, I'm going to do the update, man. Off. It's a lot better. It's it, it, it still. It's still yesterday. Yeah, yeah, nah, do, yeah, do it, do the update, do the three point It's not three point one now. Yeah, I try. I, I, I mean, honestly, I, I'm, I, I'm, I'm like, yeah, I, I'm real, 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 like, cause like for me that and the, and the four hundred four, like it has similar features. Except for that right? the track don't have like, effects yeah, like four hundred four. It, it, yeah, but I, I'm talking about like as far as like <clears throat> sample track, like it, you can use it as an audio yeah, interface. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I can plug yeah. the guitar in, I can plug and plug my synth in. You know what I mean? Like like I can do the same thing with the 404. You know, um, but like the sample track is like and it, the one thing I will say is like they, that compressor on there. Like I threw some drums in there, and and, uh, and I was very 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 impressed by that compressor. Like, like, it turned you having the yeah. drum smacking. I forget which which compressor it is. It's like a multi band yeah. or something like that. Might not be the multi band. I, I the forget next, exactly two, the last two, the two things are hard on there. The last two master which effects. I don't, I don't know which one you're talking about. It's either the, the maximizer joint or that multi band compressor. It, it, yeah. One of them two. But I know I turned that joint on and I had I had a drum loop in there and I was like, oh, okay, mm-hmm. this joint is serious. Like this little box can, 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 can really really like boom if you needed to. But like. Uh, but but like I said, the workflow had, had kind of had had that's that's what kind of was just like yeah. So look, you can use that like a sample <laughs> track too if you use an outside sequencer, right? You can load up all your stuff on the sample track, and then mm-hmm. your MIDI channel one is channel one on the track, two is channel two, three is channel three. So like you can load up samples, drums, and like some instruments, mm-hmm. right? And then sequence it from something else. Yeah. You know, but but I'll be honest with you, I, I, don't, I don't even think I'm gonna yeah. get that far with it. Like I, I'm, I'm more than likely I'm gonna sell it because it's just it like it's literally sitting in the case, been sitting in the case for months. You know what I mean? Like, 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 like I don't, like, I don't like. It's never a time where I'm like, oh. Like, <laughs> no, so I do that, actually. I do. I do feel like sometimes I'm like, this would be a good one for the sample track. No, you know? yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah, not but that's but but honestly that's where I'm at with the four four. Like like I like I've been off the like I ain't I haven't been on the gram because like cause of work. But like um but like I was like something something was telling me to oh, like like probably like two, three weeks ago, like yo, this is the setup you need to have. A computer, a four four, um, or uh, your iPad, your four four and like one extra, one other sampler, like that, like, and that's why I got the like the old sampler there. But like honestly, the old sampler, like even that, like I don't really feel like I really, really need it. Like next to the four four, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Like, like, you know. So, but I, but then again, I did find a video from where I, I was using the old sampler, and I just ran some drums in it. Yeah. So look, it's gonna stay. It's the gonna be like a spicy. little. It's, they just, it's, they not even like that they smack so hard. They just, they just sound really, really fun. Mm. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, they kicks, the snares, everything got their own like character. And and I feel like I got, I, I know I can like emulate that with plugins and all that, but I don't, it's just like, this is the real deal. Like, I don't have to like, it, you know, it's just the real, the real dirty deal. So like, so that's that's what I'm using for as far as right now. I'll, I'll probably some, find some other creative way to do it too. You know what I mean? Okay. Any other thoughts on this uh, chaos joint? I think. Listen, if you're out there and you really, really like like the uh, the way that that the, the, the screen goes and all that, they have the old chaos pads that's available for under what for three a fraction. Yeah, I think the the chaos because it's a KP three is like three four hundred online, and then they have the little the little small handheld ones out that I I, I didn't even know about, but they, those are, you can use them as like um, effects boxes too. You just basically touch your thumb to the pad, and you can get reverb, delays, mm -hmm. and all types of other uh, like modulation effects. The too, X Y joint, sure yeah, those are dope. I've been wanting one of those, one of those like the yeah. chaos mini. <clears throat> Yeah, I've been wanting one of those for a while, yeah. man. Yeah, I was yeah, that's, yeah, for that shit, yeah. but I never got it. So that's why when I saw this, I was like, oh, I'm getting it as soon as I saw it. Because I was feeding for the old one. But It looked like Sugar Bites um, type of stuff, like artillery or like a mm. tornado or whatever. Like it had like those type of effects before Sugar Bites came out, though. Korg was doing that for mm. a minute, you know. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, I never pulled the trigger on it. Facts. Yo, I, listen. Keep that yeah. for me. Yeah, don't get rid of that shit. Keep that. Dig into it. I'm telling you, when you dig dig into it, like you you're gonna be very. Uh, I think like I, I've been digging into it lately, and like I, I can't. I, I'm actually like like I, I'm 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 mad at myself for like all the time that I let it sit. But I mean, like due to like circumstances that was going on in my life, like it I, it wasn't gonna get the attention. That, that I needed to, to give to it in order to like really learn it. Mm -hmm. But now that I'm understanding it and understanding how it works, it is a very, like it's a complex machine, but it's very simple. I, I don't know if that, if that, if no, that makes I think sense. It, yeah, I mean, it's deep like, for sure. But it's like, you know I mean? so to me, it's not counterintuitive, but it's like the, the workflow part, like using that exit button and then hitting that remain and mark button for like certain things. Like I have to like have mm -hmm. the book open because I'm not there yet, right? Because I haven't been using it for like weeks. After if, if I use it for like a week or two, I probably have it, you know, like that. But so I do have the sample track mostly like that. And even still, I still got to have a book open yeah. now and then. Like, how do you do that one? Now, thing? but wait, well, let me ask this... you: Do you think that because the the four hundred four is crazy menu diving? Mm -hmm. Does that sample track mm -hmm. have me mad menu diving? It too? does. Yeah, yeah, I mean, not, I'd say yeah. I don't know. So I think the sample the um, four hundred four has more function since it's like an effect box and you could do buses and stuff so the menus might even look more complex on the 404 but on the sample track you got like a decent amount of menus but they're kind of like in places where it might make more sense but that might be just because i'm there mm -hmm. so like when you're in a song mm -hmm. you go to the pattern edit or you could go to your main system menu but then if you're making a beat your menus are pretty much like what kind of instrument do you want to use what sound do you want to use yeah. and then you mm -hmm. sequence a page yeah. you know yeah could you don't want the one thing I say that like the like with with the menu diving like where I remember from the sample track, 
it literally tells you how yeah, many pages yeah. there is. Mm-hmm. You'll be like, it'll yeah, say one yeah. out of four, two out of four. You know what I mean? So but you know exactly what page yeah. you want. When you get to the you system know, menu on the 404, though, it's a lot. You got to turn those knobs and then start going down. They're like, oh, shit, which way? Well, but that not only that, they, they're always doing the update and changing it. So it's like, okay, now we got this. Now we mm. got that. And let me yeah. just say, as a person that has <laughs> been using it faithfully, I still can't remember all the shit. Like, I have a, oh, I have no, a notepad no, no, with, with certain little things. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> that I know, okay, I like I'm like, going to lie. I got Yeah, for sure. With my little book at oh my god, with my little Shit. book, at, I got a little book you, that I keep that I keep with me. Yeah, you know what I mean. So as I learn things, I'm writing right. Right, little tips and tricks that to, to make yeah. your, your flow go quicker. But even the um, there's so much to it. I forgot. Like, geez, when you were like, yo, how do you change the the default effects? I'm like, I don't think you can, and you could. Yeah, yeah. I forgot yeah. about it, and I was like, oh shit, this is yeah. awesome. Yo. Yo, let me tell you, there's um, there's a um, there's a um, unofficial um, manual for it by this guy named Nia Tao, N E A R T A O. Um, just just type How in Nia Tao. Is it SP- old though? Nah, he he, okay. he, he has he, he he updates it as as they have uh, as as they update the machine. Okay. He updates awesome. it. He updates it like it's like now. There's certain things in it like he. Cause I, I'm, I've been reading it like I, I've been reading it like, like back and forth on the train. Like I'll go to whatever part I need. I'll, I'll read like certain things in there. He hasn't like fully, completely updated and stuff like that. But and however, like it's it's much it's a much easier like explanation of how to do things than the roller man. Okay. That I'll put it like okay. that. You know what I'm saying? Like it, like he speaks in terms of like a person who's not not the rolling is not is not speaking in terms of a person who's gonna use it, but like when you read in Rollins you be like, mm-hmm. yeah. yeah. But this guy yeah. saying, yo, do this, yeah. this, 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 and this, you know what I mean? Listen, so, half the times I well, find shit by accident. Push the mm-hmm. button that I wasn't supposed to push or I did something that and I'm like, Oh, okay, that's this means that. <laughs> Let me write it down. <laughs> But let's. But uh, but hold on. I, I I gotta I gotta I gotta give gotta give flowers. It's, it's two videos on the We Sample Everything page. The day one and day two with the four four. <laughs> That's the ones that those was my training wheels when I got back on this bike. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like I'm not even gonna Yo, hold you. Yo, people love it, those two videos because they're good videos. Let me tell you. L- listen, like there was somebody in there that, uh, 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 under one of the videos, like yo, I've been a teacher for X amount of years, and the way you explained it was clear and to the point because you explained it and you did it at the same mm. time. You know what I'm saying? Like a lot of people, they like they explain it, and it's used to be watching it. It's like what? You know, and it just and like, what they say versus what you see it just. Oh well, shit! Thank you. It, yeah. You nah, know what's nah, funny? Nah, I'm you. Cheese. It's funny because if I'm not mistaken, I started to make those two videos for you so that when you got your shit, because it was in back order, remember I had mm, mine first. Yeah. I was like, oh, I so I'm going to just get this ready for him so that when he got it, he could just go quick. Well, good. Well, they was mm. there waiting for me. <laughs> was I ghetto? Was I being ghetto in those videos? I don't even remember. <laughs> nah, yo, nah, nah. You was like, Yo, yo, this is the calmest I've ever heard you. Like, I it says that yeah, 404 <laughs> must, must have got some value in it. It was, it was he's like, and this is what I we're going that. to do today. First with the 404. Now you, and then you know what happened? Yeah, you, you had the British accent and everything. <laughs> Not British. You know what probably happened? Probably in the midst of me doing that, I was like, well, let me just go ahead and drop this on YouTube for everyone and try to sound decent and <laughs> not be so ghetto. Yo, <laughs> let me tell you, don't join us, don't join us, like, don't join us, like, yeah, because people like I, they message me and on, they always ask me to do more and I'm like, listen, I'll get to it. But it's yo, just like they change so many things, which is a good thing. Listen, I'm not mad. I'm glad they keep changing, rolling. I'm not mad at you. I'm glad you keep, you know, giving us the firmware yeah. and what we ask for. Mm-hmm. But it's just like so much to keep up with. Trust me, it's oversaturated. But when things is oversaturated, it don't mean that that everything out there mm-hmm. is good. You know what I'm saying? Like, like you, you, like you. You know, you 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 got people that's already asked you. I'm telling you, if you take if you was to take like maybe take like two months, right? Just record a video each day, but don't put them joints mm-hmm. out. You know what I mean? Put little little blips here and there, mm-hmm. dip, 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 and be like, yo, this is all coming from my course. Maybe that maybe I'll do maybe like I'll do a bunch fire. of shorts. You're right. Well, I think we got a good episode on this uh, chaos. There's really not much yeah, more facts. to add. You know. 
let us know below in the yeah. comments your thoughts, people, on the price, on the, on the yeah. little specs, the pros, the cons. And we and, and, and let's 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 keep it a buck. In the comments too, let us know what they should add. Mm -hmm. You know, it, it would like because I I. I I doubt Korg is watching everything, but I'm sure that they are. I'm sure they they gotta have it. They gotta have it in the street I somehow, somewhere. You know what I mean? So yeah. So yeah. Let them know. Let them know in the comments. What should they add? What would you add to it? You know what I mean? Like like mm -hmm. you know. Besides the obvious that we've just stated, you know. Mm hmm. You know what's funny? Mm -hmm. That that uh no battery pack bothers me so much that I would take that over a sequencer. I swear to God. I would make that shit work. That resample will come be my best friend. I will make it work. Yo, I, I'm not gonna lie. Hold you. I, I, I'll be, I be on the 404 for hours and don't hit the sequencer. I just, like, I get a nice little loop and I'm just fucking That's putting what I'm drums saying. over it. And then I'm looping the drums and throwing that. And then boom, boom, boom. And I have like, a, like that one bank will have just like like you, you, you can you can go from pad one to sixteen and see the progression. What app didn't you know what have I mean? a sequencer for? Was it Koala? Some one of these apps didn't have a sequencer for a long time. But you guys know how I am with my memory. I smoke too much. Nah, Koala always it did. Had, Koala always had a sequencer. Yeah, Something yeah, yeah, yeah. that I fucked with didn't have a sequencer for a minute, and then they added it. But you know, I made that shit work too. And I'm not even mad about the no batteries. I don't care that there's no batteries. I, I care that I can't even plug a battery pack in it. Like that shit was a big, big turn off for me. I don't care about the RCAs. I work around that, whatever. We got wires, it's okay. Mm -hmm. I'm sure we all have plenty of RCAs. The, the, the micro SD bothered me, I'm not gonna lie. That, I was like, eh, I don't even have those shits no more. I threw them shits away with phones that used to take them. You know what I mean? Like, who even <laughs> has them? Yeah. But. But nah, the uh, the nah, the, the, like you said, the RCAs. That's that 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 was a gripe. But it was like, all right, yeah, I could, I got RCA. Right. Cables, you know I what can mean? work like, around that's, that. It's not that's not a big thing. You know what I mean? But like. What what's the biggest uh, thing yeah. for you guys that, that as soon as you saw it was like, nope, I'm not doing it. Besides price, <laughs> if it was price. See, question for me. It was a sequencer. Yeah, the sequencer, yo. Like the lack of a sequencer. Like, like how do you how do you how do you how do you have that machine that looks like that? Yeah, you got true. sixteen pads on. You already know who's who's going who's going I and be like, Oh shit, I'm going mm. to get one. And you get the imagine you get that joint home and you 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 got your sample you done sample everything you wanted and you like, all right, let's go. And you like you looking, looking, and hey, where the sequence <laughs> the thing about it is, so like even DJ turntables now, um like the mixers now that have like those um pads on them. You can sequence with those. Mm. You can make a beat on it, That's hit true. start, make a beat, and then just hit stop, and then it'll keep on looping that, That's like true. just a dirty loop. You know what I'm saying? Like no, yep. no MIDI mm. or nothing like that. But like you need to at least be able to have some kind of way to like make something, right? Because if you're scratching, let's say it's just for people with turntables and they don't care about batteries at all, right? So they got their turntables up, they got a mixer, they're doing something, and they're like, well, "What do I need pads for?" You got a couple sounds, right? But then what if they want to like rock something to the beat? A record's playing, right? You can just hit mm -hmm. start and just like make a little percussion loop or like a little uh, kick and a snare, put a uh, four on the floor down real quick, yep. and then just hit stop right on beat with the, with the record, and it'll just keep on going. You could take the record and yeah. you know, you know, forward and backwards, you know, just to make it stay mm -hmm. on. Yeah. But like, if you can't do that, then you're losing because like the turn, like now DJ mixers do that. Mm -hmm. Like, why would somebody want the external hardware? They'll just get yep. a better mixer. The jet, like them Jazzy you Jeff joints, you know what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. Like, where you could, like, hit the sample and scratch it mm -hmm. and you make, like, exactly. a little yeah. loop with it. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. No, now... Yeah. Because they got the cue points. Yeah. On the, um, on but the, now that mm -hmm. you say that, Bri, maybe there is a function in there that you can do that. We don't even know because I didn't see any of these channels talking about yeah, that. Yeah. Yeah. It'd be pretty um, stupid not to have that. So maybe it is. I don't know. I mean, know. For, for performance, that's all you really need. Like, for, see, if you're in the studio cooking up, like, a groove box style, and you need a sequencer, you know. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. But see, like, to me, it's like, if it, if it was meant for DJs, then why did they send it out to people who, like, make content for yeah. DJs? Right. Yeah. Yeah. 
You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. And I know like beat making that like there's a there's a overlap with beat making and DJing. Mm-hmm. But there's there's a very mm-hmm. big like <laughs> there's a line. Like you know what I mean? Like like I, I have like I've DJed before in the past and I would never consider myself a DJ because I, I'm DJ, I'm DJ yeah. uh, start and stop. <laughs> I mean, I, I mean? got the place, like I got the turntable right to go digital joints, but at the same time, like, yeah, I, I don't really need a lot of DJ hardware because like the software does that mm-hmm. st- that same stuff too. Like, even like, yeah, yeah, like yeah. most um, any program lets you make like a loop out of something. Oh, you know what else was uh, this was something that that was like it just it caught me and it, and, it, and it bugged me out. You can't zoom in on the um, you can't the audio oh, no. No, sure that's about you. nah. It, it, like you, 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 you could, you could, you could, um, well, you could, you could scrub, mm-hmm. but like as far as it is, is as far mm-hmm. as you can zoom in. See, I love that you know on the I mean? SP so, on the four hundred four that you could get right up yeah. in there and zoom. Yeah, you got to turn; yeah. it's not touch, but still, the fact that you could yeah. get in there to that, the very edge. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And that's like to me, like if like that thing, I think it's, it just looks too good to be that just that that bad. You know what I mean? Like, like you know, like. Like, I don't know. Maybe, like I said, uh, like like Brad said, maybe it's just an alpha. Mm. They, 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 they still, still figuring it out. Yeah, I think he's out. right. Maybe, maybe it's not 20 weeks. Maybe it's, mm-hmm. maybe it's 180 <laughs> weeks. No like, way. <laughs> you know how we are. We so, cancel like, shit after know. a few weeks. Well, we ain't get it yet. Cancel. <laughs> you know, you done did that before. You know me. <laughs> nah, I did that shit twice already. Nah, but I'm the same twice, way because you yeah. get impatient. Like, that's a lot of money to be sitting around waiting. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, and, I, and most of these stores don't take the money until like the, the order goes through. But I was like, nah, I'm good. Mm. Like, you know, like that's that's how I ended up with the um the tracker. Mm. You know, the yeah. Polyan tracker, which has been sitting in the box for a couple months. But that's when it's dope. I ain't gonna hold it. That's it's on the no sale. I got it. no sale list. Uh, for what? For now. <laughs> for now. For now. Okay, so like See, that. it's funny how how like that's, gear looks and yeah. works visually with some people. Because for me. I hate the way that tracker looks. I don't like how it Just looks. The same way but I think it sounds good. <laughs> yeah, yeah, same. But see, I love the way that that uh that chaos replay looked so much. I was so instantly fired. Bored. I was like, "Ooh." You know what? I didn't like how it looked, and I still am like on the fence. I mean, I know what it is now, and I have a better feeling about it. The SP12, man. When the, when the SP12 mm. was out, like I, I was on NPCs by then, Ooh. right? And like when the first when the first you know mm-hmm. when it first came out, I wasn't I go I wasn't hip to that because costume nobody on my block had that. There's no internet and there was no like you know beat maker magazines mm-hmm. or none of that stuff, right? So I'd never seen anybody have an SP12, and I definitely hadn't seen anybody use it until way later in the 90s, like uh, like I guess after like YouTube came out, man. But um, mm-hmm. I, I don't really like how it looks, but it sounds amazing. That's the thing about it. Like yeah. low fi 12, I agree. It looks it looks better. <laughs> But it's menus on there too, though. Too. The th- I mean, it's not a whole lot of menus, but it's a decent yeah, it amount is. of menus on there. But that sounds amazing. Mm. You know, it does. You know, that, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna lie. That one, that one, it, it you, it's crazy because that one sounds, it, it sounds, it literally sounds like it's like. I like the Lo-Fi years. 12 workflow better than the SP 1200, right? Neck. So like, I, I never used the hardware, but I got that ESPI 1200 app. And it's like one to one, no. Nah, wow. But I'm saying just programming it, right? And then I think it's a, um, <laughs> I got that SP12 yeah, plug in, but you, you get the sequence set outside. But the sequencer on there is, I guess it's one to one, like the hardware, and just like making the beat mm-hmm. and then the swing and stuff like that, like the quantized swing of it. It's a little bit off to me, man. I'm not. Mm. I mean, I'm not like New York, man. And it's like it's that, a certain yo, type of uh, style of beat nah. that you can make with that good. But then like Manny Fresh, of course, mm-hmm. he, he made mm-hmm. it sound totally different. But um. Yeah, I'm, you know, I'm sure he, I'm sure he, was yeah, so it's like, tempo. um, I, it, you gotta, it's, it's like a really good drum designer, right? Like, if you have a sample and you mm-hmm. chop something up and you chop it up in the SP, it's gonna sound unlike anything else, it's gonna have a different kind of hit to it, right? And it's gonna be kind of like, uh, kind of flat or like have like a, a hip hop drum sheen to it, right? Then we sample mm-hmm. that and the other stuff and play it and sequence it, it's cool, but like. I don't have anything that can outside sequence the, you know, the ESPI 1200. And I'm not sure if people do that with the um, hardware either. You know what I'm saying? I think they just use the sequence. Yeah, yeah. I, uh, I haven't, that, that, that ESPI 1200, I, I, I don't even want It sounds good though. You heard it? But why you don't try, um. Yeah, hey, I got it. 
I I have it like then and, and they like they stopped they basically they started the app this kind of left it right they released what like one update and then I mean it's not mm. so like I could work with it now it's, it's not buggy it. the last update fixed some of the buggy stuff right yeah uh huh oh really I haven't I, so wait let me ask you that. bro you said you can't outside sequence that not on the not on yeah it's an like independent up? app on, on that? the iPad. Like it's not like a plugin. It's not AU so oh, or so anything like, like that. You can't like run, app. Yeah, I can't say let this play those pads on um, the computer. I don't think you but can either. You what can't bring it into um, AUM or Loopy I either. Doubt that. Nah. And then same thing on nah. the on the Mac. So it's a nah, computer see. version of it. It's a Mac and PC. So right. I have it on my desktop, right? And I make a beat on the iPad, ESPI, save the beat in iCloud, and then go pull it up on my desktop, and then mm-hmm. s- send the stems out, which you can do. That's pretty cool. But um. It's just a sequencing part, you know, like you know what I'm saying. Mm. So can you like, but it it, it 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 can't take MIDI in. Not on the software, <laughs> but not this version that they got. I mean, it's not made by Rossum. Mm. It's, it's like oh, just wow. a, a dude's clone. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but no, I'm just saying, like, cause you know how, like, you, you, you like you just like. Just get a, a like. I was thinking maybe you could hook up that. Um, oh yeah, yeah. No, you can make a, something that. trigger it, but you gotta map it. You can't play like a, you can't take like a note yeah. and say play across a keyboard or like you know what I'm saying. No, no, I ain't, no, I ain't talking about that. I'm just talking about just. Like oh yeah, having, yeah, yeah, yeah. Something can play. Yeah, without the using no, yeah, yeah. I had like the um the Akai LP8 is the perfect, perfect. Mm-hmm. Like for the iPad, I put the LP8 on. You got the eight pads because eight pads on the SP12, right? And then eight knobs, and mm-hmm. then the knobs are just mapped to the faders. Hmm. Hmm. You know what I'm saying? Okay. And then just change your banks, and then I could say, mm-hmm. tell it, I want exactly to do tune, or I want to do mix, or I want to do levels, mm-hmm. and then just start turning yes. knobs and, and then move yeah. them. You know, so I've had like a hands on feel. That's what I'm saying. I use it a lot. Okay. It sounds good too. Like once you do the aliasing, you take a pitch, you pitch it down. Oh man, it's magic. It sounds like, you know, 80s hip hop, 90s, you know, mm-hmm. DJ Muggs. Yeah, I remember you was on that hard body. Yeah. I mean, it sounds super Imagine. good. That's what I'm saying. So, so it sounds better than the pocket operator. The sound of that, even the SP12 app, sounds probably a little bit better than a sample on the Lo Fi 12. If you're talking about a sample loop mm-hmm. having an alias and feel to it. Now, the heart, the, really? yeah, now chopping up drums, I think the Lo Fi 12 might, it might be better to me as far as how it feels. But I think um, on the SP1200, mm-hmm. it might have like more integrity. Like, your bases might have more bottom to it and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Interesting. You gonna make me pull that app up? You know I got it. And so I look, played with yeah, it. I was about to say I might have to. <laughs> so get a loop, right? Chop it up. Even if you just like sample a bunch of instrument, you know, drums in it one at a time, right? But then start messing with the tuning, and then mess with the start and the, the decay. You can make the decay mm-hmm. do this really like super short, like snappy sound to it. It's like trying to call quest stuff, like all that Dilla type stuff. Now Dilla was doing up the MP or other stuff, but mm-hmm. like some of that early stuff was like had that. It's like a pop. Like the easy mo B and stuff like that. He uses it a lot, you know, a lot. But I don't hear stuff like all the way popping. But it's like a certain sound to it that it just makes it smack. Like a real like East Coast hip hop sound to it. I must check this out. Okay. Right. I might look into it. But <laughs> I think <laughs> the, him and the yo. Yeah. <laughs> what do I got? <laughs> OP one. That's what I got now. Yeah, that's it. That's I see it right there. Next to that's the uh, what's, what's this thing? The joint called you the, see Zen, that? the Zenthian that you got oh, right okay. there. Yeah, yeah, I see yeah, the gold box right yeah. there. Yeah, yeah, yeah I see I that. I didn't know how much it was on screen. So, like, my <laughs> camera can't even see that. Yeah, y'all can see. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, the Zenthian. So, yeah, I'm doing this. I'm doing yeah. like a uh, I've been taking stems, right? And um, trying to reharmonize the verses and the chorus of somebody else singing, right? And then I got I got that um, free this song I get high, you know the one the Styles piece sample, mm-hmm. and I'm gonna do mm-hmm. the same thing, mm-hmm. kind of like chop the first part of it, but then just take the vocal stem, and then redo all the chords and make like a kind of like a techno hip hop type. Uh, okay. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to like rechange the patterns. I'm gonna play different instruments on it, but let her still sing the same words, and mm. then just keep it going like that. 
Well, yeah, I probably use like the Xanthian okay. for the MIDI stuff. Well, I'm about to have. And then, Shit, how's yeah. your Saturday going? Shoot, sure, yeah. yeah. <laughs> right about yeah, to have no, a no, Nah, it's not. It's gonna be hip hop. It's gonna be like my bat. It's gonna be like my bat. Yeah. All right. Because I use synthesizers, you know. Oh um, shit. Yeah. Listen, we listen. We just, we just spent twenty minutes doing my <laughs> yeah. The my, yeah, they want to be in the my bad group. Now. I'm off. They're like, nah, I can't. You're out. Take take our hashtag off. Oh, yeah. oh now you won't come <laughs> home. No, oh, no. Facts. Okay, well, anything else we got to add before we close out this show? We good. Thank you for watching and listening. Uh, pod listeners, if you want to see the episode, go to the the link in the description or go to YouTube and type in We Sample Everything or go to WeSampleEverything.com. Yeah. So we got free sample packs out there. We got tutorials. Sam- we got all type of things. Just go check us out. Thank you for watching. Peace. Yeah. Peace.